everyone. Welcome to my little corner where there's no wrong way to play with paper. We're doing another 30 days of sketches with Christy from Christy's Beautiful Life. And yours truly started, well, I thought I was filming, but I wasn't. So <laughs> here we are. I've already done a little bit, but we are doing day 14 with Brandy Robinson. Here is her sketch. It's a two page layout. Lots of fun indeed. I've done mine a little different. Remember, the sketches are only there to inspire you. I'm sure even Brandy would tell you she just wants to get you going and um, just wants you to use this to jump off of. And that's basically what I've done. Now, she has a whole um, thing matted and then she has paper. What I've done is I've taken a 12 by 12 from the Spectrum Gardenia 49 and Market. I've cut it down. And then I put some border strips. That's what she has done. And then I just allowed my white background to be over here. She has lots of clusters, which is kind of fun, right? Because she has three here, so that page has a focus. She has a cluster here. We have many triangles we could do. And that is a lot, a lot of fun. So do it your way. It's okay. It does not have to be exactly like that. You can be inspired over on Christy's Facebook group and her YouTube channel. She's doing a layout share every single day um, for 30 days of sketches. The link for Christy's YouTube is, um, her playlist is below. So you can see what everyone's doing with the same sketch in their own way. Tell Christy I said hi when you join her Facebook group because you can print these off, you can play the bingo game, and you can have a lot of fun. You don't have to be a YouTuber. So tell Christy, Ginger sent me. <laughs> All right, you guys, so let's just start having fun. Obviously, I've done the base. I already started tucking things. I Well, I thought I've been talking to myself, let's be honest. So <laughs> we're just going to go with the flow. I'm using the 49 and Market, one of my embellishment packs that I made, you know, just like the page kits. You, I went over all of that before we even started. And then I have some goodies here from my friends. And now I'm at the point, I've kind of decided where my clusters are going to be. I haven't decided on my title. These are pictures of Jillian and Junior and her older sister Jasmine. Jasmine and my older daughters, they were just such a blessing to me. They helped me so much. I was an older mom at that point. I was 36 when Jason was born. <laughs> you know, like, oh my goodness, I can't even. It was a lot harder when I was older than when I was, you know, 19, 20. <laughs> so, <laughs> um, I want to just start building up these clusters. So I've taken some of those and I've Put them in and then I have this was made by Deborah Bray. She's over on Ginger's Corner. She's been swapping with me since the Love Our TS days and I absolutely love this and it has some purple owls and you guys know I love owls. So we're going to go off that and this says we're owl in this together. <laughs> How cute is that? So I think, gosh, there's two different places I could put this. I could go here and then cover this up with my title which I don't not like, but I'm not 100% sure. Then this is at the point where I looked up to make sure I was in camera and I was like, oh, I'm not even, not even filming. <laughs> Talking to myself over here. Or I could maybe put this over here and I kind of think I like this better, which means I got to find something to do over here. That's not a bad thing. Now to bring in the pops of green that you see in this paper, I think when I go to glue it down, I'm going to use these Timu um, Flatback Gem Flowers that I got and I'm going to place them on the purple leaf branches. Um, I have said this lots of times. I first started, I kept like, I'm finding it really hard to use the colored leaves. Oh, I'm not. I. I, I said that, but honestly, it just kind of comes together. I don't know how it even happens, but it does. Okay, so I will use those instead of enamel dots when I go to glue it down. And then I just have some goodies. I have these owls that someone gifted me, and they are purple. They have some of the black and white vibe. Let's see if maybe we can't pull a couple of these out and maybe use some of these, like they're sitting on the branches even. One here, 
We could maybe put one here. We'll figure out where they're gonna go. Even maybe this color, that purple. How does this go on here? Oh, just like that. And then it's supposed to have an orange little beak. Could even have the heart as a beak. Hmm, I don't know. I don't know if I might put them together. <laughs> I might just play with them. Okay, so let's see if we can use that. Then what else do I got in here? I do have some circle elements. Might be able to use some of these. Maybe even some hearts, we'll see. Pull those out. I do have these owls as well, which could maybe work. So sit there. Ooh, I have beautiful feathers. Oh yeah, those were made by Michelle. She gifted me those. I have some leaves. I just got all kinds of stuff in here. All kinds of stuff. This is really pretty too. I like this. Isn't that pretty? Um, What else do I have? All right, I think we have enough. Let's see if we can't build this up a cluster. Oh, look, this was from Terry. I believe Terry made this. Oh, Sandy Riley, Terry's friend. I believe this is from her bestie. Isn't that pretty? She made for a swap. All right, so I'll quit gabbing. I'll, I'm gonna stop. I'm gonna stop. All right, so let's start here. Maybe I can add an owl to this. That's kind of cute. I even kind of like this one better on there. And let's see if we can't make this a little bit more pronounced down here. Hopefully I'm still in, in camera. Like so. Okay, we don't, we don't, we don't want the ear in his mouth. <laughs> no, we're gonna avoid that. I'm almost wanting to do, what if I took the string off and I put the owl here, and even this one? Okay, so let's take the string off the tag. This was made by Cheryl, Captain Cheryl. I don't know what she made this, what swap she made it for, but it's absolutely gorgeous. Everybody makes such beautiful things. I do like this here, maybe. Maybe we could go, that one looks better. I think that one looks better. Okay, and we have a little bow. So that's good, I like that. I'm kind of wanting to put either more purple leaves or what if we tuck this down here? I don't have to see the words, right? I could just tuck that down there like that. Okay, I do like that. Just like so. Then we need this side over here. Maybe we can put this there. Ooh, I kind of like that. Okay, maybe, maybe, maybe. We could even use this circle and have it just trial and error. That's all I'm doing over here. Oh, breaking stuff. Okay, so I would place that so that the word memorable or moment would show better. Do that, I like that. And we have just a little bit of the um, leaves popping out. I'm liking this. Oh, I could have some of this going in here too. That doesn't, that looks good. And I would fix this or I could use this. Ooh, which one to do? I think, think we're gonna leave that. I don't think we're gonna use those. And let's see here. What if I tuck these? Nope, I don't like that. I can already tell you I don't like that. I do kind of like this color, but I'm not sure. What if I use this here? This has some of the elements we could Put the owl on here. I could even cut it in half. I mean, there's nothing saying I can't just use this to anchor it and then have memorable here. I kind of like the stripe, the black and white stripe. Or what if I took this frame and I went memorable with an owl or this owl maybe? That's not too bad. 
Hmm. I would just cut it down right here. So let's do that. Why not? Why not? We're just gonna do it anyway. <laughs> Even if you say no, don't. I'm, I'm already doing it too late. Okay. So memorable would go like this, like that. I'm liking that. And then, or should we, I think I'm gonna put it up here. I think I am. I think I'm gonna go just like this. Have memorable here and my owl tucked in right there. Could I do two owls over there? The possibilities. I could even take the other half of this. Look, I'm just gonna tear it even because I'm gonna tuck it in and go like this, just like so. My owl here and then maybe another owl there but then that gives me hmm where are those feathers what if i could use those feathers <laughs> you guys know you're hiding them from me <laughs> let me find the feathers did i leave them on my layout oh geez they're right there i thought i had more than two though no maybe i already used some Maybe there was just two. Okay, let's see what we can do here. So I could take these this beautiful feathers and let these go up here. Put this in the middle. Oh, I like that, that's pretty. It's pulling in some green. Now, I don't have any green here, but I'm not gonna stress about that because my flower gems are gonna do a lot of that. So, just think maybe I want a different, different owl. Maybe even just leave this there and do the owl right there. Oh, isn't that cute? Okay, and then maybe I could even stick this because I do. I only had a couple of these. They were left over from a different layout. Maybe I can stick this back in here. Give it some presents. Oh, I like that. Okay. And I've got the darker green. Got darker green. I'm not going to totally stress about no green because there will be some green with that. And then I think I'm going to put a journal block right here or right here. Just, it doesn't need to be a whole lot. I might even use a border strip to journal. Look, I have these and I could border strip journal, right? Just put like some stripes across there and tuck in some more flowers. So should we do that and represent that? Here, let me write on these so I know just how many I have. I'll be right back and we will um, try to put my journaling right okay. here. Okay, so I've done the border stripping. I'm thinking maybe we should tuck in a few flowers, florals like this or these aren't flowers what are these these are leaves have this go here this is for this page and then here i can tuck in some more up there i'm just gonna grab some out of my purple bin that is the page i've let, let's go over what we did do i can even put some of these down and kind of how these clusters are working in my mind it doesn't mean they're the right way, it just means the way I'm doing it. You guys totally do it your way. So then I will have these throughout the whole layout. They will be represented throughout the whole thing. So here's how my mind works when I'm doing these clusters, right? So first of all, is there green in each cluster? I've got green here, green here. I have green in his shirt, pretty prevalent right here, but then I'm also gonna have green here, so I'm good right? Then I've got a black and white element, black and white element, and I have the background is white and there's black there. There's another one. Then I have an owl, an owl, an owl, and little owls in the trees. I'm good there. And then I will have these gems all over the whole page. And to me, that just works. It just comes together. So let me glue it down and I'll come back, talk about whatever I do different. You guys know me. I'll be right okay. back. I've got it all glued down. I added all the gems. I pretty much did everything that I said I was gonna do. I put all of the owls up on foam 
And I did also ink the edges with a um, Distress Oxide Shaded Lilac. Just kind of, um, I, I didn't do the middle though because it's gonna sit like this, right? So I just did the three edges on each page. I just felt like it gave it a little more, this is a vintage vibe anyway, and I like that. So um, then I wanna thank Brandy for inspiring me. Mine is not exactly like hers, but it definitely inspired me to um, use a lot of photos. I love two-page layouts, you guys. And I have done others that ended up being two-page layouts. I'll share that when we're all done with 30 Days of Sketches. I want to thank Christy. I want to thank all of you. I'd be honored if you gave the video a thumbs up if you liked it. And with that, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Be blessed. Bye-bye.